long since we have vlogged so this feels so weird but I'm so excited to be vlogging again yeah I don't have my bed frame anymore because it broke and so I had to get rid of it and now it's just my mattress on the floor and it's like perfect height which I kind of love we've got a bunch of other stuff to update you guys on and we're doing something so fun in today's video so about to pull my cereal and I realized I don't have part of it. So. This is not a cute angle, but we're just gonna deal with it because I don't have a good camera set up in my car. Oh, let's not go forward, otherwise I'm going straight into my sister's car. Um, so, I'm off to my PT class. We've also been going to this new gym just like a couple days a week, um, which I've really been loving. I just love changing up my environment and like my atmosphere when working out because if I'm in the same for ages, I just lose all my motivation and I just get like bored. So yeah, I've just really been loving my new routine lately and I'm very excited for my PT this morning. So guys, I just finished up my PT and it was so good. Um, we did booty and now my glutes are on fire. Why is the camera it's so blurry? I did nearly back straight into a Porsche or some sort of very expensive car before and that would have costed me a lot of money. So thank the universe that that did not happen. <laughs> breakfast get ready we can see Livia she should be home from the gym soon um yeah this coffee shop actually makes the best coffee it's so good it's so yum I got my fresh sourdough let's go cool. guys I'm in a really good mood today and I think it's because we're vlogging and we just haven't vlogged in so long that I'm just so excited and I've missed it so much Good morning guys, so I just got back from the gym and you would have seen Ashley vlog a bit this morning. I thought I should just give you a brief life update because it's been a little while since I've vlogged and obviously this is my life and what I have, the community I have built on here, I feel like, you know, I need to fill you in. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you probably wouldn't have seen, but the past few months I have been doing long distance in my relationship and we just spent three weeks together and he went home yesterday, no, the day before. So the past few days have been very emotional and just kind of like navigating those emotions, getting back into routine and like obviously saying the goodbyes and stuff, which all come with long distance. <laughs> so if anyone's out there, I'm sure they can completely understand and relate and it's just a whole roller coaster of emotions. <laughs> yesterday I was, you know, having my ups and downs and a little bit sad. I thought it would get better as it goes on, but it didn't. <laughs> Today I woke up like way worse, just like sobbing on the way to the gym. I came back inside and actually had this little note on my bed and it was so cute and I just started sobbing again. Obviously it's been quite private the past few months, but yeah, we've been doing long distance for quite a while. And LT is the and emotional support system. If anyone else is also doing long distance, I would love to hear from you because those sort of words of encouragement have really helped the past few days. I've had a few, obviously a few followers and girls message me on Instagram which has been really nice. And obviously I will share advice or anything along the way but I'm still in the early stages and still navigating it myself so <laughs> when I figure out how to deal with it, which I'm dealing with it really well but yeah I will definitely help girls out as well if I can. So 
we have all gotten ready to go somewhere. Very exciting. <laughs> is it exciting? Is it exciting or is it gonna be traumatizing? Not sure. I'm sure if you guys are on TikTok or whatever, you've seen it somewhere. But basically we're going to take a trip up to Brisbane and we're going to go to the Karen's Diner. It's technically meant to be run by typical Karen's. Basically um, they're just like really mean. They're meant to be like mean. The service is meant to be really bad. We don't really know what to expect to be honest, but we're just super excited. It's something we've wanted to do for so long and we're gonna go with a few of our friends. I'm so, already in a very sensitive mood. Will they make me cry? We'll look. Shall see. <laughs> but yeah, I'm very excited to see what it's like. Uh, we're just gonna like go experience it, bring you guys along, do a big review and yeah. Hello! On our way to Karen's diner! Hello! <laughs> so what are we doing today? We're going to Karen's diner and we can't wait to get bullied. What's Karen Steiner? I actually well, think we I'm way too sensitive for a place like this. Yeah, no, I reckon I'm gonna cry. <laughs> the us three will and Jackson will be giving it back to them. Yeah. Well, um, they actually asked if I wanted to put in a special request. No, they didn't. Who did they you pick did, on? They did. And so I just put something to pick on for everyone. <laughs> Except myself. <laughs> back in the day in high school when me and Olivia worked at a pharmacy, we actually worked with a lady named Karen and she was actually the most lovely oh, lady ever. Like she was the mom. complete opposite to the stereotypical. <laughs> Lori doesn't know what I'm, Jesus. I'm trying. Oh, we're turning. We're turning. No, no, no. No, no we're, turning, we're turning. We're turning. All the way around. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna laugh the whole time. Wait. I'm already like speechless. It's just like stuff that they're saying. Deep fried Karen. <laughs> see, I want to see the manager Karen. Alright, this shit. What the fuck, man? Who are you recording for? Because your friends are fucking here. <laughs> Simple process. Last you order, last you eat, last you fuck off. Okay? Paris doesn't want to be, what do you want? Can I please get the basic, Paris? Oh, fucking boy. Soft Daniel boy, what do you want? I'm not sure yet, I'll let Jack go away. I'm sorry, I'm... You don't know. I don't know. I know your life is together, but at least get your fucking order together. Hurry up. Right now. Basic Wait. 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 You're gonna eat honey barbecue. We got a cousin with sweet potato chips. We got a royal with regular fries. A basic curry for the basic bitch. I couldn't take makeup with the fucking mic. Sweet potato chips. Coke Zero. Something I can't handle regular Coke. Five wing buffalo sauce. Blue cheese inside. Correct? Yeah. yeah. Say sorry. Baby, can't you see? I'm 
I'm tall, I'm tall, eh? I got like you. I know that song, but I didn't know how to sing it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I was really happy to have you on this one here. So, good morning, everyone. Take your fucking wings. And fine, everyone. Yeah, I'm going to stand for 20 seconds. Um, Sorry, this is not good. Your line to propose and confess your undying love to this custom media. Yes, you are. Hurry up. One knee. Let's go. <laughs> You are so wonderful. Can you please marry me? Why do you want to marry him? You are just such a wonderful guy and you stole my heart. What, what's wonderful about him? Um, your curls. Your curls? You probably know this. <laughs> what, how has he stolen your heart? What has he done? Uh, it's really fishing, isn't it? To get anything out of you. Alright. Did anyone enjoy that? Did you enjoy that? Did you accept the proposal? No, no. I don't know why now. Because if you ever try to confess your love to me like that, I will not be impressed. Okay? Go and sit down. Take the chair with you. You're done. To me. May I please get the menu to get this out? I'm not actually going to talk to him, so I need you to repeat back what he says. What did he say? He wants to learn. Yeah? What about him? Does he want a menu or something? Yeah? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I got put in the fucking maid dress. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you did. 
<laughs> um, but I just sat there laughing the whole time. But it was pretty funny. So guys, um, that's gonna conclude this vlog. It was only a small one, but Karen Steiner was very fun. Actually, a lot better than what I expected. Apparently they're opening one on the Gold Coast, so I really wanna go to that one when it opens as well. It feels good to be back vlogging. We had a little rest, a little break off. We did have a video filmed and organized for like the past few weeks and it just did not work. Like we had issues with the audio, yeah, the audio and the filming. It didn't work. Lots of technical issues, but anyways, we're back and yeah, just wanted to outro and say thank you so much for watching and make sure you subscribe and follow us on all our other social medias to stay up to date with our life. We will see you in our next video. My turn to shine. Hello world, you <laughs> missed me, I know you did. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's enough now. Cut the cameras. <laughs>